Lately, what I'm finding um, is, is the innovative technology that is making storage kind of shift from your traditional, you know, storage array with RAID groups and whatnot. You know, what you'll find in um, a lot of the EMC products and various other vendors are, are, are going towards is a tiered storage solution where you no longer have to really put a lot of, you know, thought or, or not, not so much thought but research into how much IOPS or how much performance a particular data set will need. The technology allows you to create what's called a tiered pool and where you can have slow, medium, and super fast spindles in one storage pool, so to speak, and the software is smart enough to identify which blocks are hot and need to be on the faster spindles or on EFD disk and which blocks are, you know, maybe not accessed so much and it automatically will move those those blocks down to, you know, a slower spindle that, you know, could be SATA or, or some type of slower disk like that. Um, another thing uh, that we're finding is that as technology progresses, it's becoming more of a, an environment where we're becoming data brokers in the sense that we're thinking about, you know, how much is it costing me to host my data in this location versus that location? And we're finding that it's much easier to move your data back and forth between the, the more, more expensive tiers to the least expensive tiers based on these type of algorithms that this, these storage arrays are using to move your, your blocks beyond the different tiers. So let's say you've got an environment where most of the data is archived data. So it's written to disk and then it just sits there. Well, if I've got a multi-million dollar storage array sitting in my data center, it's costing me a lot of money to host that data in on that storage array, whereas I can move that data out into the cloud where it can cost me, you know, a, a fraction of that price. So, in that sense, it fascinates me because the, the role of the storage admin or of the system admin is shifting into more of, you know, a data broker where you are determining, you know, based on a cost-benefit analysis, where can I get the most bang for my buck? Where should I keep this data? And how should I move it there? 